Here we're being asked to figure out the magnitude of the resultant. So first of all we'll add up all the x components there. That's the horizontal components. We get 7.52. And then we'll add up all the y or the vertical components. And that'll come to minus 8.38. So our vector from its origin goes out the x-axis 7.52 and then it goes downwards minus or downwards 8.38. So this is a right angle triangle and if we can figure out the length of side R mark there that's the magnitude of our vector. So the square root of both sides there uh, stick in the numbers and we get 11 uh, we get about 11.26 for the magnitude of the resultant.